Ah, it's still very early because we've written to the Minister of uh, uh, Social Development and the Minister of uh, Treasury and they are DGs. So they have responded. In fact, Treasury has responded. They gave us their side of the story because the main thing was to check from them what can be done to make sure that the um, uh, grants are paid uh, quicker and what elements are there to assist in the process of making sure that going forward um, whoever pays the grant they are paying them legally so and then DSD also responded to say they were waiting by then for the decision of the constitutional court so we will follow up with them just to respond give us all the documentation we are investigating basically why, why the delay to implement the court constitutional court decision uh, from our side that was an own initiative investigation but what we received from the DA was for us to investigate the relationship between uh, the minister and CPS yeah so it's still at a very early stage yeah will you be using the uh, most recent concord uh, judgment to guide your probe mm. um, yes we will be using that we are still waiting for the constitutional court decision Ooh. so now um, she promised that as soon as the decision is out then they will respond to us so it's for us to follow up and say okay now the decision is here can you then go ahead and and and, and respond and uh, remember, we will have to give them enough time because we'll, do, we'll request all the documentation. Um, uh, it's still at an, an early stage, still a preliminary investigation. And that will guide us whether do we proceed or we don't proceed to the investigation.